raced. I, I've heard you've raced against uh, 20 Owens. Twenty times. Twenty times. How did you fare against? Uh, Never Owens? beat him. Ever. <laughs> but uh, we traveled around the around the state here, putting on exhibitions, and uh, they didn't want to see me. It was him, you know. But uh, we raced against each other. Do you remember um, where you were when you heard what he did in the Berlin Olympics? Did you hear that on the radio, or did you hear that in the newspaper? Do you remember uh, no, hearing it? I heard it in the, uh, I saw it in the newspaper because by, in 1936, I was in the police department. I was hired me in 1934, and they had a, they'd gone broke, and they decided to have a field day and hire some athletes. They said, get that redhead. I was in the 32 finals Olympics and the 400 meter hurdles, and I had a lot of stuff in the paper, you know, so I was hired by the police department, and I figured I'd just uh, stay till the depression was over. That was a bad time, a very bad time in the early 30s, but it didn't get over, and finally I've got two kids, and uh, geez, I don't know what I'm going to do about it. I didn't want to stay, you know, but uh, in 19, uh, let's see, 13 years later, anyway, 12 and a half years later, Cass Tech in Detroit called me and wanted me to start teaching, coaching. Hmm. And I was ready to slam that gun and stuff down on the desk and quit. And I found out I'd have to do 30 more years. They wouldn't give me credit for my 12 and a half in the police department. To get, so uh... I talked it over with the wife and I said, well, I've been promoted, and uh, I'm not out on the street like I used to be, and I'm, uh, I'm going to stick it out and retire. And I stayed for 25 years and one second, and I got out of there and come right up here, and Chrysler hired me. I got hired right there. Now, you, now you interviewed with Fritz, right? In, uh... Oh, yeah. Well, you see, what was, what's behind the reason he hired me is that Back even in the late 30s, when no one was allowed to touch weights, any athlete was bad, I contacted the York Barbell Club in uh, York, uh, Pennsylvania, and I began to study weight training, and nobody was using them, no athletes at all. But in the police department, they were paying us 12, 10, 8, and 6 for the first four places. And I was making $60, $70 a meet, which would be the equivalent of $500 now. So you were running for the police department? Oh, yes, they paid oh, us. Oh, I didn't know that. 12, 10, 8, 6. But I was a regular patrolman, I did. Okay. The only difference was from May the 15th to August the 15th, we went out to University of Detroit to train in the police field day. Okay. I have pictures home, a picture home, of the police field day with thousands of people in the stands, and it shows me breaking the 100-yard dash. 